Five years ago, Jerry Dorsey had a stroke and suddenly his life changed drastically. He needed a new heart, so doctors placed a device inside of him until he could get one. Four and a half years later, the phone rang and it was a call of a lifetime. God was supposed to send me an angel. He sent me a whole team. Doctors at Northwestern Medicine Bloom Heart Hospital performed a first-of-its-kind transplant in Illinois. It's called the heart in a box. Doctors can use a heart that stopped beating, resuscitate it, put it in a box, and keep it going until the transplant. Transplants are usually done using hearts that are still beating when taken from the donor. I haven't even had a chance to express anything yet because I've been just going through the pains of just wanting to get back home and get comfortably, and then I can realize that, hey, you're back. I spoke with Dorsey's coworker Liz Bowden, who says this was well deserved. Jay is beloved on campus. He is well known and well loved on campus, and people have been really excited that he finally has gotten a new heart. Dorsey won't be the last one to benefit. Doctors say this new technology is a game changer. It will allow almost 30% more hearts to be available to those in desperate need. For Dorsey, the last five years could be considered a blur. I feel like I'm just right back to the person I was, and I'm still working at my own pace. I'm so glad you're doing better. Bowden was nearly speechless when I asked her what it meant to see Dorsey back on his feet. Sitting with him five and a half years ago, seeing him now, to now, it's been an incredible journey, and I'm so happy that he's finally to this place. Sometimes all it takes is a second chance. He has the biggest heart in the world, so much so he needed a second one to finish his life. Dorsey surgery could set the new medical precedent and could help thousands seeking a heart transplant. In 2021, over 7,000 patients were on the heart transplant list. Jess, back to you. Incredible procedure. All right, Chance, thank you so much.